wake up birds? Before Freddy Krueger and Candyman, this chick ruled the dreams of the kitties. Here's the legend of the Kati Kati Ya witch. It comes from the Cook Islands, so that explains hips about the girls. <laughs> Jikes. This story of the witch is not suitable for a young audience, but the young audience is very suitable for a witch. It contains a bit of yucky stuff, so grab a fork and akarunga mai to story. Once upon a time in a land far, far up the road lived Maeva. She was in love with Tama, who was just too sexy for his shirt. They used to meet up in a secret cave and do the boom boom? Yeah. She wanted to marry him, but the people of the village said no, because he was from a different village. Maeva disobeyed and ran off to get married to Tama, but like all little moi mims who do things behind their parents' back, the chief of the village found out, and then he came to banish Tama forever. She was so sad by this. She went to her secret cave and just have a cry. Stuck in her cave, she started turning into an ugly witch and looked like precious. Precious. If the village ever caught a glimpse of her, they would crack up. Ah, what a ugly, what a ugly. In order to get back at the villagers for not letting her marry Tama, the witch started to eat the children of the village, and no one really knew what was happening to their guts. Two warriors were sent out on a mission to find them and saw Kati Katiya picking kutus out of a little girl's hair. Then suddenly, oh I'm gracious, they saw the witch throwing the little girl into the umu. They leapt onto the witch but underestimating her Harry Potter powers. The first warrior was wrapped around Kati Katiya's hair and got stabbed by her ugly fingernails. The other warrior got Ika and pierced the spear into the fatu of the witch. She was still screaming as he chopped off her head and threw it into the fire. Eww, yeah the Kati Kati we was Kati off her head. Kati Kati witch is gone but her cave remains in Rarotonga. Kids go to have a nosy and see what it looks like. Let's hope they never meet the starving witch. Nekamana.